So very good evening to you. Welcome to the Olympic Park here in London. London 2012 Paralympics. I'm Jeremy Nicholas. Alongside me is Katrina Webb. Hello, good evening, Jeremy, and good evening to you out there watching us tonight. Katrina's uh, four times gold medalist for Australia in the Paralympics. And uh, we're straight into the action. They're off to a very, they're very, very much running to time. This is seven o'clock, and it literally is seven o'clock, and they're off. And this is the men's 400 metres, the T12. So we'll uh, pick it up as we go. But we've got a couple of Spaniards, a Tunisian, a South African, and a Mexican. And it's the uh, South African, Hilton Lingen with them, in lane five. Uh, you can see there in the yellow and green who's going very well inside him Caldi of Tunisia going very well he's already passed the Mexican that's Gonzalez and the two Spanish runners on the inside uh, can't make any headway at all at the moment but Hilton Lingenwaffen uh, in the lead and Caldi Mahmoud of Tunisia is the only one who's going to catch him Hilton Lingenwaffen for South Africa but uh, he's getting some grief now from the Tunisian who's coming back at him it's a good race to finish here Mahmoud of Tunisia coming past. Kaldi Mahmoud's going to get the gold. It's gold for Kaldi Mahmoud. Hilton Lingenwiffen gets uh, silver. And it looked like the Mexican, Gonzalez Sosida, got the bronze. Fantastic race there. A new world record for the Tunisian. What a finish for him, that last 100 metres. Strong, running through the line and great result. A time of 48.52 with the... Previous world record being 48.62, and uh, Lingen Wiffen got a PB of 49.04. So he did his uh, he did his best there. He couldn't have done much more than a PB. Uh, and he looked like he'd got the race won, didn't he? And uh, the Tunisian just had kept something in reserve. That last hundred metres is the most important, and it is whatever you have left. Also, the person Sasuza from Mexico who uh, came third also ran a PB uh, of 50.41. So. What do you want to see in a final? The T12 men's 400 metres world record, PB and PB. And the Mexican's got a Mexican hat for his lap. The Tunisian's got a flag. At this point, it looked like the South African had it. And then just as uh, they came around the bend, still you would fancy the South African, but then the Tunisian had uh, kept something in reserve. And Kaldi Mahmoud came by to take the gold medal. And that's always a tough moment when you're really exhausted in that last 100 metres when someone runs past you and uh, you saw the South African just tense up a little bit in his shoulders. You want to hang on, but your body's telling you that you're exhausted. Then to see someone run past uh, is a very tough moment in sport. However, if you're going to come second, broken by a world record, uh, and you ran a PB, he's got to be happy with that. Were you a good finisher or were you someone that got caught at the finish? Experience both, actually, and okay. I think uh, in sport, when you're involved for that long, part of your journey is to, it's good to experience both. So then the next time, if you do get past, you know actually how to handle that feeling. So we were straight into the race as our coverage uh, started tonight. They're slap bang on time here at uh, the London Games. And there is the result. A new world record for Mahmoud Kaldi of Tunisia. Hilton Lingenhefen of uh, South Africa, 49.04. Mexican with lots of names, Jorge, Benjamin, Gonzalez, Sosida, we'll give them all of them, 